morning. Welcome to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. Hope you're all having a great day. Stop making fun of me for not doing Sebastian's quest. Natty takes priority. Okay, so I actually looked it up and also asked some friends and it turns out that Natty's last quest actually doesn't unlock until you've done Wand Mastery. So I suppose I'm doing this now. Look, we'll do Natty's quest and after that I'll do Seb's quest. Promise, okay? I just I'm just saving the best one for last or maybe the worst one for last. I don't know. I okay, let's make that one so we can do Natty's quest later. Also, can the game textures please appear? <laughs> Good God, this poor game. The update really destroyed it. It took ten minutes, but the game finally got its textures together. Hello, Miss Lavender. I wondered if you might be able yeah. to help me with Make something. Make the one. Yeah. Yes, Professor Fig sent an owl informing me that you'd be coming. He was a bit cryptic. Said you need to have a special wand crafted, that you'd bring me the materials. I have them right here, yes, sir. I have them here. Oh my! How extraordinary! Remarkable design. Are these usable for honest, making a wand? I have never crafted a wand in this fashion. Do you know how to? Repaired broken wands, of course, but this is something else entirely. Is this a mini game? Keeping you on my toes, aren't you? I think I can work with what you've brought me. Yeah, good. Let me see what I can do. Yes, please. Thank you. Oh man, I thought it would be a mini game. Baby's so worried. gave up again it is done the stupid patch what is it whoa nice i should warn you i've never seen a one like this before okay My suspicion as professor fig implied in his letter is that it serves a unique purpose I That's doubt you should find much use for it otherwise. I understand. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I. That was straightforward. We got our wand. I'm afraid you're on your own. What the hell? I've ensured that we have a moment to ourselves. Oh, come, come. No need for such theatrics. What is he doing? In light of what Ranrock now knows, you must agree that our interests oh, no. are aligned. You are your interests are never aligned. Our interests will never be aligned. That exactly. You would let goblins take what is rightfully ours. There is nothing that particularly the belongs to us. Belongs to wizard kind. We would be fools not to work together. Nah. Now you suck. What's that you've got there? Don't. Might this sudden visit to the wand maker have something to do with our mutual pursuit? There is no mutual pursuit. Shut up. I have no idea what you're talking about. That repository is my birthright. Charles no one Lord cares. Wouldn't have wanted you near it. Good point. The arrogance. Should have known better than to try and reason with a child. This child is smarter than you. I've always said, children should be seen and not heard. You little f This is the little f that got stabbed. I never thought I'd regret not learning Crucio. Wait, I'm sorry, shouldn't we do something? Oh my god. Well, I'm very over leveled, so I don't care. Let's get over here, you little. Wait, when did we did go and how did this happen? Get over here. What is happening? Wait, 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 w
Where did we go? How did we get here? How did this happen? And it's this guy. It's one of these guys. Woo! Wait, no, I meant to throw the TNT at them. Dude, I can't even tell where the enemies are. What happened? You little You shut the hell up. You're the reason I is. How did we get here? How did this happen? What is going on? Oh, Did I just explore Victor Report? Honestly, for what he did to Annie, kind of deserves that. I can't believe it. Rookwood's reign is finally over. Oh, that's why I need to I'll do this before Night is first. I right away. For now, though, I need to get back to the map chamber and tell Fig what's happened. That was so much to process. Rookwood shows up, pretends that our interests are mutually aligned. Children should be seen and not heard. You little f you're the one who cursed Anne. Totally deserve to be exploded for that. Honestly, wish I could have crucified him. Please meet me as soon as possible. Oh, thank God. I received an interesting owl from Joanna Bickle about Harlow. <sighs> I was just about to just do Shadow of Relic. And I was nervous like I want to do 91st, then I'll do Relic. Maybe I'll just do Shadow of Relic today. I was not prepared for that. Yeah, let me just speak to Poppy really quick. Then we'll uh, do Harlow's last chat. I know that's Natty's last one before she has a final chat. Hi, just Poppy. The person I was hoping to see. Yeah, I was hoping to see you too. Hi, how you doing? I see Doran finally convinced you to leave the Snidgets. If anyone can keep them out of poacher hands, it's the Centaurs. Centaurs are very smart and they want to be. I wanted to thank you. Oh. When the poachers ambushed us, I... It was nice not to face them alone. Oh, I was happy to help Poppy. Of course. I love you. It's the sort of thing friends do for each other, isn't it? I suppose so. I am glad you came to Hogwarts. It's Aww. already been my best year. I love you, I wouldn't Poppy. want to repeat of Hauntel Hall, of course, but I did enjoy the Three Broomsticks. Had no idea how lovely it was there. You've you never been to the Three Broomsticks? Oh, yeah. I used to spend most of my time with Highwing, and well, I don't know how <laughs> Serona feels about hippogriffs popping in for a butterbeer. No, well, you're I my best the only one I would have gone with. Or Gran, of course. Can you come with me now? High wing is good company. With that, high wing's good company. She is. Although I am beginning to see the appeal <laughs> of her human friends. It was nice to talk about my parents and Gran with someone. And share high wing. Uh, you're my bestie now. We can go drink butterbeer together. I love you. Have you heard any from your, anything from the parents that don't care? I don't suppose you've heard anything from your parents, have you? I haven't, but I'm perfectly fine with that. Good! And Does your grandmother? Know that we found the snidges. I couldn't hold it in any longer. I told her everything. Was she mad? She was livid that I'd been anywhere near the poachers. But she confessed that she was rather envious about the snidges. Oh, well, as a grandmother, of course she'd be worried. But okay, Poppy, next time you want to get into trouble, just call me. I'm one hour away. It has all been a pleasure, Poppy. Do try and stay out of trouble. She's my best, you know, I love her. I can. We've taken on poachers twice now, successfully. I'd rather think you've helped me develop a taste for it. Well, just call me next and time you want to take down poachers. I might actually go looking for trouble. Just call me. You and I should meet for a butterbeer soon. Perhaps Hywin can join us? I would love that. Let's see how Hippogriff feel about butterbeer. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad, Poppy. Poppy is my second favorite name. I don't think you can pick a favorite character in this game. I love Sebastian, I love Natty, and I love Poppy. I just love all of them. Anyway, now we can um, fight Harlow. Natty, bestie, here I am. I can't wait to kick Harlow's ass. Come on, let's do it. Where is she? Am I here at the wrong time again? Are you ready to finish Harlow? Yeah, I've already finished Rookwood. That was awesome. Time to finish Harlow. It will be fun. I'm ready to finish Harlow once and for all. What is your plan? I received an owl from Mrs. Bickle. Mm -hmm. She wondered if we were having any luck going after Harlow. 
suggested we could gather evidence from a friend near Manor Cape. What but more evidence do we need? To stay out of it. Was rather adamant about it. Yeah, we already knew. Harlow knows that we saved Archie and that we rescued Mr. Rabe. The letter didn't come from Mrs. Bickle, did what? it? What? I do not believe it did. Harlow intends oh. to ambush us. But now we have the upper hand. We can prepare. We are stronger than Harlow, and he knows it. That's why he's resorting to this sort of trickery. We must go. Okay, I am worried, Natty. I have plot armor. I don't know whether you have it or, or not. Please stay close to me. I can't have a repeat of Rowan. So let's slow down a bit. I don't know if we should be rushing into this. If he thinks we are aware of his plans, he may call off the ambush. We should behave as he expects oh, us to. Oh, he has Fair a point. point. All right, let's go. Brilliant. But, 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 but don't. Sweetie, I don't want you to get hurt. Hallow's reign ends today. Yeah, at the same day as the report today. to inform Officer Singer of our plans. Yeah, what is she gonna do? I already sent her an owl to let her know that we were following a lead given to us by Mrs. Bickle. Okay. Are you concerned she might tell your mother? Indeed she will, but so be it. I am tired of hiding it from her. No, I, I just don't want to get hurt. I will not be safe from the Ashwinders until everyone is. Huh? I shall pursue them until they are finished. And I think she knows that. As do you. Yeah, but I think you're still gonna get grounded. <laughs> you're still gonna get grounded. Keep you're still gonna be grounded. Hallow is likely around here somewhere. Yeah, and this is also I a dude. He is close. You are. Where this is, is also he? a dude who won't know. hesitate to use the we killing curse. Around. So slow down. We don't want anyone dead. Of course, there are mosquitoes here. As soon as I get into a. No oh my God. <laughs> We do not care. Let me. You will not survive this fight. Oh, come on. Yes, we will. I am very Let's smart. Wait, just wait. I'm just going to do this in magic. You are so stupid. Oh, come on. Let's do the transformation. Okay. I guess I'll just continue for you. Thank you, Daddy. Okay, okay, okay. Yes, finally. Bent on target. No. Oh, you get over here. What the hell? There is more? Guys, 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 what makes you think? What makes you think you have any chance here? I am literally 10 times stronger than you. Wait, there. Of course I am trying. I'm trying more than you. Little Nat Sionai, in it? And her excruciatingly loyal companion. Don't you dare just Natty. You two have done quite a bit of damage to my business interests. That was a good report. That was fun. <laughs> but I must gradually give you some credit. What was once a mere annoyance has become remarkably problematic. Yeah, and I'm going to become your new remarkable Fortunately, problem. Fortunately, I pride myself on my problem-solving skills. Hmm. And, now. Must this. and I have it in my dick so I can. Oh my god! Oh my god! Wait, how is this? Okay. Ah! I nearly one shot the man. Wait. Which button from the one? <laughs> he got back up, dude. I emptied your health bar. Why are you still doing? Oh no, he's down. He's down. Ancient magic. PNP. Amazing. Except at least, thank God it wasn't Avada. She better be okay. Are you okay, Bestie? 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 Are you sure you are up for a visitor? Bestie? Bestie? Yes, are you okay? 
I feel fine and it will do me good to see my friend. Bestie, you didn't Very have to well. do that. But do not overdo it, not say. I've mean already that. been under Crucio before. That was I did you did not have to do that, Bestie. Oh my god, it's good to see you too, Bestie. You did not have to do that. Are you okay, Bestie? I'm glad to see you're doing so well. I am doing better than it appears. I am only here because my mother insisted mm -hmm. just to be safe. How are you feeling? I was really? relieved when she told me that you were all right. What on earth possessed you to do something like that? <laughs> I don't know, but what other choice did I have? You were in danger. I don't want that I'm to sorry, go Natty. It's my fault you got hurt. What? <laughs> no. <laughs> do not blame yourself for this. The moment that I saw Harlow aim his wand at you, well... You just got a factor, huh? You did what came naturally. I suppose it was instinct. Yes. <sighs> I could not simply stand there and let you get hurt. Then I shouldn't feel guilty? Of course not. There was nothing that you... Oh. Oh my. What? I cannot believe that it took what? me this long to see it. He made a choice. Based on instinct, oh. my father, you, my friend, are no more to blame for my injuries today than I am to blame for my father's sacrifice years ago. From what I know of him, it seems there's a lot of your father in you. That's very kind yeah, of you to perfect. say. I hope that you are right. This has all been a bit much, hasn't it? Well, I took Taking down, down Hollow and the rest of Rookwood's life. And Rookwood's dead, which but is we fine. we have done it. Rookwood is dead, Hollow is on his way to Azkaban, and the rest of them are on the run. A few oh. of the dregs will still be about, fighting for their lost cause. But Rookwood's enterprise has fallen apart. I just realized something. Safe for now because of us. Because of you. Thank I love you, Ned. we make a formidable team. You, us. my fellow traveler, have enriched my time at Hogwarts beyond anything I could have imagined. Thank you. I believe your friendship to be one of the most important in my life. Let me hug her! <laughs> Thank you for coming to visit me. It is always good to see you. <laughs> I love you! And you're gonna be okay, Daddy. I love you so much. <laughs> yeah, but I just realized something. I killed Rookwood. I probably shouldn't have killed him. He could have... We could have checked. There's a page in the hospital wing that I have never noticed. Anyway, uh, um, we could have used Priory and Contatum on Rookwood's wand to figure out how he could stand and that could have helped us heal her. And I've only been recording for 45 minutes. <sighs> as much as I hate to admit it. Yep. Yes, yes. All, all of you have been waiting for it. I'm doing the Shadow of Relic quest immediately. Maybe I should have been prepared with tissues, but I am too lazy to get up. I have to do this. I have to do this. I don't want to do this. Well, you guys are about to have a field day. Sebastian has gone too far. You saw what lies in the catacomb. I cannot stay here. Spiders? Wait, Anne, please. Ominous. He was willing to put the whole hamlet and himself in danger on the chance that some old relic could help to heal me. Whole hamlet? I'm sorry, Ominous. Make sure he's all right, will you? What is he doing in there? I'm glad you're here. Wait, where is she going? Okay, never mind. Okay, that's fine. What happened? What is going on here? I received your owl. Where's Sebastian? Inside the catacomb. Frankly, I was surprised you weren't with him. He didn't tell oh, me before he even. Stop. You swore you wouldn't let Sebastian take this one step further. Yet here we are. He didn't tell me. He didn't tell me. It's my fault. I was wrong. I thought he'd stop. I should have stopped him before. Sebastian's in real trouble now. I'm going back into the catacomb to find him. Anne's right. He and the entire hamlet are in danger. We are the so place far from is the crawling hamlet. with Inferi. Oh Inferi. my god. What are you talking about? You'll see. We need to hurry. I hate Inferi. I hate Inferi. I hate Inferi. I hate Inferi. Sebastian must not be in his right mind. Well, if the entire hamlet is in danger, then maybe you're right. If the, but the, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared. Last time I don't we were like in fairy. This place was crawling with spiders. I thought we're the spiders were the worst effect. Let's find Sebastian quickly. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. Oh, I'm going to see your companion for this one. Oh, that makes sense. I mean, I've already fully looted the place before. I don't Where think was I need Sebastian to... when you and Anne found him. Yeah, good Just question. Ahead. 
in a great room. This looks different from when we were last here. Ah, stupid and fairy, stupid and fairy. I hate and fairy. I hate and fairy. I hate and fairy. I hate and fairy. Ow! I hate and fairy. I hate and fairy. I hate everything about and fairy. I am actually quite lucky that I'm overpowered. I hate them. I hate and fairy. I hate everything about and fairy. I hate them. These favorite enemy, probably Sienna's pocket. This place looks vastly different from the last time we were here. More and fairy. God. Why is Benny in theory before? There's no sign of Sebastian. <laughs> yeah, he was. This is the great room. He was here last. Okay, I have the high ground. Nope, that one was not. Food. I'm just wasting my time here. Okay, no, there is no point using the high ground. Just get over here. Ominous, you stay on the high ground. What? Why are there so many infants? Oh, of course. Yeah, I thought, no, wait, no, wait. Frick. I hate Infinity. I hate Infinity. I hate Infinity. I, how many times have I said that? I just hate them. Ow. There's still more. Go away, man. At least when Infinity. Hold on a moment. Uh, what? Yes, what I happened? I was so worried about Sebastian, I didn't even realize. Anne's gone to get Solomon. Why? When she first saw the Infinity, she thought Sebastian was being attacked. But then he showed her the relic and said he'd learned how to use it. What? The carvings on the relic were... Yeah, I knew that. And Sebastian somehow created them. Not exactly. He's controlling them. Huh? This is powerful dark magic. Creating in theory is incredibly difficult, but controlling them... What is happening? As Anne and I frantically barricaded the inferior to keep them from escaping, Sebastian kept mumbling about healing Anne. When Anne said she couldn't stay here, I didn't realize what she meant. Solomon threatened to go to the headmaster if he heard of Sebastian dealing with dark magic. Uh -oh. I need to get to Hogwarts. I must get to Professor Black first. Twist the story a bit. Make him think it's a family You would do that? I'll be back as soon as I can. See if you can talk some sense into Sebastian. What makes you think he's gonna listen to me this time? Be careful. Okay, you be careful. Why is she trying to get Solomon? Does she... Does Anne not know that Solomon will... Not help one bit. It's honestly amusing. What is this dumbass doing? Also, where is he? I just see more infinity. Too many inferior. Too many. I don't like any of this. The thing about infinity is that once they're on fire, at least they're weak. They're weak as hell once they get on fire. Where the hell is he? I'm worried. There he is. How do I get there? Do I go the other way around or? Is he just raising the inferior or is he controlling them? Because this is stupid. Why is he raising inferi, by the way? How is that helping? You can't kill something to sacrifice that's already dead. So that doesn't make any sense. Ah! Sebastian, sweetie, you little dumbass. What are you even doing? Oh, more of this, huh? Stupid bone puzzle. Yeah. This is not the time. I am so stressed out right now. Because I have no idea what he's doing. I'm worried and is getting Solomon for some reason that I don't understand. Yes, I know. I'm doing that. I'm doing that. I'm not doing Sebastian, am I? Sweetie, what are you doing? What are you Isn't doing? Incredible. No, it's not. Inferi are my least favorite enemy. What are you doing? Sebastian. I told you. The relic is the answer. Where? I've been trying to reverse the dark magic that injured Anne. But this will allow me to control it. Control what? Just as I can control the Inferi. This doesn't make sense. I had to fight Inferi all the way. I don't like it. What have the two of you done? I just got here. Shut up. Relic. Thank God somebody did it. I think that just made the inferi worse. You'll pay for this. Maybe pay attention to the inferi, please. Wait, ah! did, did this dude really, really say I'm not going to try and talk my nephew down? I'm going to attack. That's your logic? I'm honestly more worried about the infinity. Protecting us from what? You're attacking us instead of the infinity, yaar? Is this why people don't like Sarun? Why is there still infinity, yaar? There is no, there is no relic left to control. What?
What is? Why are they still in Delhi? Still, how, how is Glacier supposed to help them in Delhi? Who is the idiot who is casting Glacier? What is even happening? I'm stressed. I'm stressed. Bro, get better one liner. Mr. Seller, stop! Yeah, you ready? Your team. I'm literally trying to help. What do you expect me to do? No, I feel bad now. I feel bad. She cannot be healed, Sebastian. You must stop. You could have said that before. Uh, I won't let her suffer. Wait. The Vala Kedavra. Solomon is the one he killed. Also, why are his friends still here? What have you done? I must get out of here. I can't let him leave. He killed Solomon. I knew he would kill someone because, like, that's the point of the Avada quest, but. Sebastian, wait! No, we should leave. We should get out of here. The best I can do is give him company now. This is also too much for Anne. Seb, we need to talk. You were defending yourself just fine. What was the point of killing? Honestly, I think Solomon Salom might be the best case scenario. Better than Ominous. Because there was a part of me that was worried he's gonna kill Ominous. No time to make jokes. I'm sorry. I'll, I'm trying to diffuse attention. Uh, uh. Why wouldn't you stop? I was calling after you. Anne won't survive this. She's withering away, inside and out. Solomon's never been there for us. Not really. He gave up on Anne. I'll never give up on her. You need to you calm down. Him, didn't you? He was going to ruin her life. He attacked us. I. I had to use the killing curse. You know I did. No. If I hadn't known how to cast it. No. There was no reason to kill the man. I admit he was a guardian. There was no There was no reason to literal commit murder. You went too far, Sebastian. I I can't think right now. I need to leave. Sir I can't stay here. I need to find Ominous. Sebastian. Please, I'm not myself right now. Let's meet later at the Undercroft, all right? You're not helping. There's a part of me that's really thinking about Anne. This this upsets Anne. But then I also think about that. Why did you? Why did you? Why did you? Why did you? Why did you get him at all? Also, okay. I know I said this twice during that duel, 
But did Solomon Salo really say, Hey, my nephew has gone too far. Instead of trying to talk him down, I am going to attack? Is this why people hate Solomon? Two reasons I see why people hate Solomon. One, to justify Sebastian's killing, which honestly is no, it, that's unjustified. The murder is unjustified. And two, this man really said, I'm going to attack. I'm not going to try and calm Sebastian down. Yeah, I know this guy's a guardian, but that does not justify the murder. Stop demonizing this man. And on the other end of the spectrum, also stop demonizing Sebastian. There are some people who do this. So yeah, this kind of proves my point. Both Sebastian and Solomon were kind of equally responsible for this whole descent. No, no, I know there is a choice later. I know there's a choice. You, this is, this is why there's a choice to send Sebastian and ask Ben later. I know about that already. Yeah, no, this changes nothing. I wasn't going to send him there before, but I'm not going to send him there now either. And I have a feeling that if the relic hadn't been destroyed, then Solomon Salo's death would have literally cured Anne. That's what the relic wanted, right? A sacrifice. What was he doing grazing in ferry? I want to be done for the day, but I haven't been recording very long. And honestly, this did not mentally scar me in a way I thought it would. So my mental is still intact. I just feel sad and like a deer in headlights. Like, what? There was no reason that had to happen. Sebastian did go too far. I will admit that. But his uncle wasn't exactly helping. If anything, he was pretty much provoking Sebastian this whole time. And I'm not even saying this like trying to defend Sebastian. Like I know that was unjustified. But still, this is why I say that like they were both responsible. Why do people have to blame one person? Don't just blame one person. They were both stupid. And the worst part is Anne is paying the price for both of their stupidity. First of all, you are normally very good at telling me what's happening in the Hamlet. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you as well. How can I help you? What's happening? I'm curious to know what's happening in Feldcroft. Might you have any insight? Well, our Hamlet's in mourning at the moment, unfortunately. We recently lost one of our own. Solomon Seller, a long-time resident. Does anyone know what happened? And huh? so young. Tragic twist of fate. We've all taken it rather hard, that is, actually. That is what? The worst part is, he was guardian to his nephew and niece. She's particularly devastated. Poor girl. Already? Well, I was about to do the final repository. Yeah, I'll talk to him. I am incredibly concerned about Sebastian's mental health right now. Here I am. Yeah, did She's you? She's devastated. She just buried your uncle alone. I did it for her. Really? Sebastian. Anne can't bear the thought of turning you in. Neither but... can I. What? Turn me in? She saw what happened. She actually did. I'll give you some time to think, Sebastian. Turn me in. If it's any consolation, I don't want to do that because that will doom you. And as a Hufflepuff, I've already seen what happened to Anne this way. We are not having Sebastian spend his youth like that. Sebastian. Did you hear that? You saw what happened. I never wanted to hurt my uncle. I kind of do. I can't him. believe he's gone. How did things go so wrong? I didn't mean it. I didn't mean to. You didn't mean oh, to mean man. it. I was only trying to help. I can't leave now. I need to be more than ever. You understand. You can talk to Ominous. Make him understand. He listens to you. I need to be with Anne. Does Anne want to... I mean, I'll talk to him, sure. Don't worry, Sebastian. I shall speak with Ominous. Thank you. You're a good friend, truly. I don't think Anne wants to see you, love. No matter what happens from here, I'm glad we met. Poor how Sebastian. can you... How, how can you... How, how can you... How can you still turn him in after that? He didn't mean to mean it. I understand. That's how I'll write Drake Pick. That is exactly how I write Drake Pick. Not meaning to mean the unfavorable curse. It happens in the heat of the moment. Yeah, I'm making excuses for Sebastian out of the box that I used for Drake Pick. But, I mean, you guys knew this would happen. Ominous. What a mess. I can't believe it. After I last saw you, I went straight to Hogwarts. What happened? Before I had time to talk to Black, I heard from Anne. I rushed to Feldcroft and found her with Solomon's body. She was beside herself with grief. Part of her wants Sebastian to face the consequences, another part Ask can't bear the too thought much of it. Of a consequence. I don't want to lose Sebastian, but 
I don't think we have a choice. Yes, we do. Yes, we do have a choice. No, we are not doing this. Okay, first of all, I should preface this by saying like, I'm the idiot who didn't want Rick Pick to go to Azkaban either and would legitimately break her out if I were given that choice. In my own version of the storyline, Tusai hates the thought of Rick Pick going to Azkaban. Going to Azkaban, you're basically doomed. No room for redemption, no chance to make things right. You're just there, you're going to be tortured and Sebastian didn't mean to mean it. And as someone who writes Rake Pick that way, we can't turn him in. Also, he's 16. This is, this is will be too much for him. He's already feeling guilty enough as is. We must not turn Sebastian in. I already knew I wouldn't be turning him in. Honestly, this Relic Quest, this Avada Quest has not made me change my mind. We're not, we're not doing this. We do have a choice. What good will it do to turn him in now? He clearly regrets everything. He's not going to do anything like this again. We've both heard that before. Yeah, but, but this time it's irreversible. About Anne. She's lost her health. Now she's lost her uncle. Do you really want to take her brother away from her too? I don't think I, she wants to see him. I understand what you're saying. Perhaps you're right. As much as We're I believe that this. Sebastian should pay for his actions. The guilt will eat him alive. That's bad enough as is. Anne as well. I hope we're doing the right thing. I'll talk to Anne. If it comes from me, she'll agree with this decision. Thank you, Ominous. You're a good friend. Whatever lies ahead, we must face it together. That I know. Also, don't we? None of us can dare to isolate Sebastian anymore. Solomon's issue was that he continued to isolate Sebastian and that just drove him further. Do not isolate Sebastian now. He needs friends. He needs to know that we can help him pick up the pieces. I'm sorry, but I really do, if you turn Sebastian in, I really do consider it a betrayal. I might be biased because Sebastian is so similar to Rake Pick. Also, I love him, but we just can't do this. Honestly, I think I should just end the episode here. I've technically done three quests. I've taken down Rookwood. Somebody needs to, wait, 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 wait. Somebody needs to tell Sebastian it was Rookwood. Somebody needs to tell Anne it was Rookwood. And somebody needs to tell Anne that I messed up and killed Rookwood. I probably shouldn't have done that because then we could have found out what curse he used. That could have helped. I have made a big mistake. Is the next quest the final boss? I should actually check. The final repository is the 14th and final main quest within Hogwarts Legacy. We do delve into the final repository, have a climactic showdown against Randrock for the fate of Hogwarts and the, and the world at large. And it has the good and bad ending. No, we are saving this for the next episode. Yeah, so okay, this is the end of today's video. We did three quests, one mastery, we finished Natty, I mean finished with Natty, <laughs> and Shadow of Relic, Solomon died. Honestly, I am so relieved to finally know who died. It means I don't have to avoid spoilers anymore. Thank God. I can finally look at fan art and head cannons without fearing spoilers. And the last thing, we have one last thing left, the final repository. This is the final boss? Oh my God. Oh my God, guys. In the next episode might be the last episode of Hogwarts Legacy. Oh, 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 I'm not ready for this game to end. This has been so much fun. I'm not ready for the story to end and the final boss will obviously be awesome. There's a good and bad ending. <laughs> hey, I might do a second playthrough when I choose the bad ending. I, I'm trying to get the good ending. I'm pretty sure you get the good ending by making some choice within the quest. I've been told that there is a very obvious choice there. Oh my god, oh my god, we'll do the final, we'll be doing the final boss in the next quest. <laughs> I, and you guys must be very satisfied that I finally did the Avada quest line. Are you happy now? You're happy? I feel bad, I feel so bad for Anne and Sebastian, like, mm. like Siana is gonna go into some self-loathing here, like, oh my god, I should have stopped him, why did I not stop? You have final chats with the friends, like um, Poppy and Natty, you had those final chats with him. The final chat with Sebastian happens only after uh, the final boss. Because I've been told that if you send him to Azkaban, obviously he won't be there. In that case, Omnis talks to you. I should see that ending. But you know what? I'll save that let I'll save that the next week. Next week, once I finish the game, however long it takes me to finish the game, I'm going to look up like a walkthrough. What happens if you turn him in? I I don't have it. I I I can't I don't have it in my heart to turn him in. And I don't think Anne and Omnis do either. Like Anne is clearly torn. Omnis is also clearly torn. So basically, basically what these two did that 
yeah we are both torn you know what we'll go to the third party and ask her opinion and the, that third party was obviously me i wish we could have stopped that you know that disagreement got so out of hand that guy died on one hand now i understand my people hate solomon salo uh, this man sucks and on the other hand sebastian was still completely unjustified but i also like i'm believer in the fact that askaban will be too much he can learn stuff without askaban we don't have to do that I have a lot to discuss in the DMs of all my friends today. They are going to be yelled at because I am going to yell that oh my god this happened and finally saw it. So, if you'll excuse me, I have a lot of DMs to slide into. <laughs> and with that, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Celebrate the fact that I finally finished all the quest I'd be happy and I'll see all of you next week to face the final repository. Bye everyone have a nice day